Hey, Hope Elam, it's Pastor John with this week's E! News. Hey, I'm just out here outside on a beautiful now February day, and it's hard to believe that we are just two weeks away from the start of the Lent season and Ash Wednesday. Hey, I got a question for you today. What road do you find yourself on today? What, what path are you on? Do, do you like the road that you're on? Do you like the direction that you're headed? Are you headed towards Jesus or maybe away from Jesus today? If you kept going the direction that you're going, do you like the path that you're on? Do you like the way that you're headed? It's no coincidence that the early Christians, before the word Christian was used, were actually called followers of the way. And that's because Jesus had invited them. He said, come follow me into a whole new way of living, which he described as living in the kingdom of God. He said, come and follow me along the way. Be my disciple and learn my way. Jesus even once said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And so as Jesus' followers of the way, we are his disciples. And so this weekend at worship, we're going to discover what it means to be disciples who make disciples. We're continuing our 10 for 10 series, looking at these 10 big goals that we have at all of Hope's campuses 10 years from 2020 to 2030. And we've been in this series for a few weeks. This week, we're going to look at what it means to pass the baton of faith from one generation to the next, for all of us to be disciples who make disciples. Essentially, being a, a follower of Jesus, a disciple, and, and following the way is learning how to do the things that Jesus did in order to become more like him. So what do we do? We worship. We show up at worship every single week. Maybe that's this Sunday night, special time of extended worship called the overflow. Don't miss that. Maybe it's connecting in community. It's men's and women's ministry. It's growing in your faith. It's Maybe you haven't been to community night on Wednesday night in a while. Coming, grabbing a meal, sitting down with people, being in relationship. Maybe it's growing and maybe it's spending time in his word, continuing a Bible reading plan or, or prayer. Maybe it's doing that on your own time or getting some others in your life, doing that with others. Maybe it's serving. We've got an awesome Super Bowl food drive. I'm not talking about a football game. I'm talking about a food drive. We're going to try at all of our campuses to stock every food pantry in central Iowa. It's going to be awesome. Our lists are going to be out this weekend. And then you can hit the shelves and get those much needed items for people in need in central Iowa. Worshiping, connecting, growing, serving. It's all a part of following the way of being a disciple who makes disciples. Whatever road, whatever path you find yourself on these days, Jesus wants to meet you there. And he says to you today, come follow me. We'll see you this weekend at worship.